All right, so here we're given proportions of 0 0.1000, and uh, we can use either of these two uh, methods. We can look it up in a table of z-scores, or we can go to a calculator or a computer and use the inverse normal uh, function. And what that does is gives you the z-score that corresponds to this particular value. Um, what we're getting here, when we plug in 0 0.1, uh, we end up with a z-score that is equal to uh, negative 1.28. Um, when we plug in 0 0.9, right, this makes sense because the normal curve is symmetric, uh, we end up with a z-score of positive 1.28. Um, in part B, we're asked to make more, and so these are the des these are the z scores that correspond to the deciles, right? So the bottom decile is a z score of negative one point two eight, and the top decile is the positive one point two eight. If we go to part B and we are given that the mean is sixty four point five and sigma. Our standard deviation is 2.5 inches. Right, we're going to use um, the z-score that we calculated in the first part. Right, and we're going to use this formula here. Right, uh, that if you take your value, oops, if we take our value subtract the mean 64.5 divide by the standard deviation was 2.5 set that equal to the given z value and we solve this out um, we end up with uh, let's see 2.5 times 1.28 that gives us x minus 64.5 is equal to um, 3.2, right? And this 3.2 value is useful because that tell, uh, this should be a minus, x minus 64.5. The 3.2 is basically how much difference there is between our x value at the top decile and um, the mean. So when we solve this out, we get 67.7 is the uh, the top decile uh, for height. Um, if we do the same thing with the negative 1.28 z-score, which is corresponding to the bottom 10%, right? The only difference that we'll see is x minus one point uh, x minus sixty four point five is now negative three point two, and we end up with a height that corresponds to sixty one point three. Right. So this is the top decile here. Right. So anyone who's above sixty seven point seven inches would be in the top ten percent, and anyone who's below. Uh, 61.3 is in the bottom decile.